Hello everybody and welcome to a moving vlog. Um, yeah, if you want to see us move house basically, please like, subscribe, comment down below and let's get on to the video. So basically, me and Harrison came back to Bedford yesterday and we have been packing up everything. There is boxes, suitcases, anything you can think of, literally everywhere. Not a big flat and now there's no room to move around. But you know, we move. But yeah, we are currently waiting for my mum and her BF Peter to arrive. There was a slight dilemma this morning up in Newcastle because when they woke up the snow was woo, really deep. But they have picked up their van and they are on the way on the A one on their way down. Now I think they're like they've been driving for nearly an hour, I wanna say. And I think the 10 minutes down the road because the traffic and the snow are literally everywhere on the A1. So we're just, well, we've got things to be doing waiting for them. But they get here soon, hopefully. Be later on, be later than expected, but can't be helped. But anyway, me and Harrison just need to finish packing up. We're going to pop the Sainsbury's because my mum says she now needs wine <laughs> after driving in the snow. <laughs> Shout out, mummy. And yeah... But apart from that, we've just had, fingers crossed, some hopefully good news from the estate agent. They've been pretty bad this week, like, they don't do things unless we tell them to do them. And they're not being proactive about it. And it's getting closer and closer and we still don't, we're not officially going to be moving in tomorrow. But, like, they've been saying we can and, you know, it's just, we've been having a proper annoyance with them, basically. But fingers crossed, we still will be in tomorrow. But hey-ho. Let's get on to packing. So yesterday I emptied all of this, started packing. So there's a case, there's a box down there. There's the Hoover ready to clean. Small boxes. Bluebell boxes is all packed up in here. Then we come through here. Let's put the big light on because it is dark. Ah, nearly in. Here's a cupboard filled with packed boxes basically and suitcase. So we've put, shoved things that are ready just to be put in the van in there. Oh, the washing machine doors open, can't shut that. Then we're covering the bedroom and that's really the case. We've got all these and then we've got like a couple of boxes and suitcases in the wardrobe which we need to move before Peter gets here but this is where we're at the minute. Let's just carry on clap, pl clapping. Why are we clapping? Packing. Oh, it's still the same day. Literally haven't recorded all today because it has been like mega stressy and you know what the worst part is we couldn't do anything about it mum and her yeah, Peter got the van as i said earlier they picked that up at nine o'clock this morning and let's put it this way it is now 10 past five at night and they're still not here they're about an hour and a half away so and the issue is like we need them it's not like we can <laughs> get away without it my car's tiny we peter's gonna be like dismantling <laughs> everything because that's just what he's His job. that's just what he's good at so it's like we can't even get around them not being able to get here they've got past the snowy patch now so they're on the way the next bit thankfully we can eventually get the keys basically we're going it shuts early on saturdays as well nobody told us that so we now have to leave bedford at like seven <laughs> o'clock in the morning tomorrow for us to get there to get the keys it's eventually getting a bit on track now but it's still not like it's been yeah. It's not been a nice day, like, we, right, the thing it's is, we've long. done all we can do. Yeah. So we're literally just sitting here waiting. Fingers crossed the snow goes away because I hate snow. I don't hate it. I hate driving in it. It's just my worst nightmare. <laughs> but as for now, we're going to finish moving everything, make sure literally everything is done. And hopefully <laughs> about <laughs> an hour and a half. They will arrive and we will see a van drive past the street and I'm now probably going to cry with happiness. But anyway, apart from that, we'll see you real soon. Good job, ma'am. That was bright. Good morning, everyone. Mornings. It's very early. Oh, goodness. It's um, 5.57 in the morning. Mom and Peter are already like going around the mm. house. Um, our alarm was for six, but you know. We should probably get Actually, up I woke up about 10 too. It wasn't them. I yeah, just woke up naturally. <sighs> so we're going to get up, get ready, and then <clears throat> it'll be time to rock and roll. Yeah. Mm. Time to leave the flat. 
that. But anyway, mm. keep you ready to rock and roll. Fuck. Just fell over. Here we are. The trustworthy bee hoodie. I need to wash my hair, but you know, we move. Slick back. Got the joggers and the matching purple socks. Let's get this going. Good morning, everybody. So it is a full 24 hours since I did actually record. Yesterday was manic. Basically, we got up at like six o'clock, as you saw. And then me and Harrison had to leave our parents packing up the van because we had to get up here to get the keys because the estate agent shut early. As I said, they never told us that till the last minute. So we literally were like on the road from like quarter past seven. And then obviously like I drove four hours up here. Tired. And yeah, then we literally just had to move and it was so icy. It's like coming up our little drive on a bit of a slant. So obviously like slipping all over with like TVs and boxes. Put some salt down, but it was still like icy everywhere. So it was just like a manic day and to be honest, I had no idea where the camera was. <laughs> but anyway, we are now in the new house. I'm currently stood in what will be the kind of like office-y, YouTube-y room because it's like got really good lighting. Although there is houses on the other side, so you can probably see us right now, but you know, we move. But anyway, yeah, today I'll give you a house tour and everything and back on the game. Slept for like eight hours last night, I think, hopefully. <laughs> So that should hopefully like reboot the system after like a couple of manic days. This morning, Harrison's zooming for a couple hours, but whilst we've still got the van, me and my mum and Peter have to go get the fridge freezer because we do not have that yet. And yeah, but apart from that, I'll keep you in the loop now and let's go. Hey, done. <laughs> Peter's forced us to help, I've hurt my hand. Oh no, we're gonna lose Hayden, everyone. I'm sorry to help. Oh, who's this one? Is this Harrison? Oh, well done, Harrison. Thank you. You're doing a great job. Yeah, I fixed your bathroom issues. Mum's fixing bathroom issues with a door hanger. What's a door hanger? Here's my Hayden. Oh, Hayden, how old are you now? 14. He's old. Seven. Seven. <laughs> Aiden. Hello again. Yeah, it's been another long day. We're still going. It's five o'clock, but Mam's back to school tomorrow, and so is Hayden. To be fair. So yeah, but then hopefully this week we'll just get a like sort. So like, I'm in probably the emptiest room, but it's like got boxing. I need to like I'm back on my dressing table. <laughs> oh, the mirror's gonna fall. <laughs> so I need to fill that. Um, I need to change all the curtains, but I need to do that, but I might need some help because I they're quite long to grab the other end of the pool. And yeah, Pierre and Harrison are just finishing building the final things, which is the dining table and the bluebell box shelf. We've got our washing machine on its first wash. And yeah, that's pretty much all I can update you on. But yeah, in probably what's going to be my favourite room. End of day two of moving in. Um, showered on my sofa. Chinese is on its way. We've got the. I'll give you a spin around now. Oh goodness! Oh yeah, sneak peek. Oh look! Oh god, that. Yeah, the fake fire's firing. <laughs> TV is on 4G, not 4G. <laughs> Hotspot. Ah, you can see how tired I am. Yeah, Ali's on. Bonjour. Sitting underneath the lamp. You tired? You feeling I'm good? Shattered. Good morning! Good morning! Woo! Oh, we are getting ready to go food shopping because our fridge is all ready to be packed away. It's had its 12 hours of cooling time. And yeah, we've got nothing to eat, so let's go do that. And then we have boxes to unpack and yeah, basically it. What was I going to say? Oh yeah, this morning we're basically um. Um, MMM, why do I keep saying M? I need to stop doing that. Yeah. Yes. We have called all the gas, the electric, the council, the TV license, you know, all the fun stuff like that. That's what we've done this morning. But yes, time to get ready. So, watch your space. That was the cringiest thing I think I've ever done. Yeah, I didn't want to say it. Thanks, Harrison. Hello, and yes, I uh, thought I would show you around the house now. 
it's getting there. I've still got a couple of boxes which I do need to empty. It's mainly like Christmas presents which I need to find homes for. But yeah, I thought I'd show you around now because then I can get this video up. But let's so do We start at the front door and we have our coats hanging up, stuff to go in my car, masks because you can never go wrong with masks next to the front door because that is life. But anyway, we'll come into the door on the right. And this is the living room. Yay, loads of room. This room is like probably the size of the flat we're in before. It's a luxury having this much space. <laughs> but we have our sofas, our cat bed to be, the TV, cute little fireplace, yeah. Everything sweet, here's exercise, exercise? exercise equipment, yeah. And we just got the Wi-Fi box today, so it's plugged in either side of the room and there's the box but hey ho it's working that is the main thing so we go out in the next room this is the first door on the left excuse our washing it is drying and here's the dining room so there's our cute little table slash blue ball boxes i need to unpack back onto the shelves over here but yeah this is the dining room it's um oh, i don't know how to get it all in but yeah cute loads of space again and some wood flooring which is nice but Excuse that, that's still one pack. So come out of this room and again we turn into the left. And meeted by Harrison who's acting like he's doing the dishes beforehand. I'm just, I'm just redoing this one. <laughs> just so we can do it in the video. <laughs> and there's me in the mirror. He's, <laughs> this is the kitchen. It's got some, I forgot what colour Janet told us the way. Coloured cut cabinets, but you know, Sage. we move. I said that she gave me something else but anyway it looks better on camera actually we thought this was going to be horrible but it's actually not so it's fine back door don't need to explain anything more I mean, than back door keys, well, so outside. I'll look through the window <laughs> and this is our secret cupboard with our fridge in <laughs> but yeah this is basically the kitchen here's our cute cat calendar shout out to Gma for getting me one so I'll be a part of the clan but yeah We'll leave you, Harrison. I'm going upstairs. So much watching that to do. Yeah, see you in a bit. Bye. Goodbye. Bye. So we go up the stairs. That is right. We have a house. We have stairs. Oh, so I go up the stairs. Lovely big window here. And you're not going to see because it's now night time. And you can just see me. But we have a massive back garden. But I'll show you that another time. Let's carry on. <laughs> so you come to the top of the stairs and to our right. This is our toilet in here. I'll save you that one. And here's the bathroom. Still trying to sort out where to put things because there's no like storage. But you know, we'll work that out. We're living on the windowsill at the minute, but we'll sort that. We'll leave that room. So we come into bedroom number one. This is ooh, storage. We are going to get a bed here eventually for people to stay over. Hayden, are you ready for sleep with us, hon? But here's the wardrobes, again, washing basket. It's basically just storage because we have so much stuff. And you know what? There's so many cupboards in like the walls and it's so handy because like, I can show you this one. This has just got like suitcases in and random stuff, but we really need that space. <laughs> there's another one of the secret cupboards. So we go into bedroom two and I think I should watch you a secret clip of this. This is like the office -y dressing room lovely room here's our old sofa from the flat lovely jubbly and there's my dancing board my dressing table with my ring lights oh look peace it's me again lol ha. but yeah that is this room it's lovely another big cupboard but yeah we then go on to the final room of the house the bedroom Woo! this is where we sleep yes We've got a glow in the dark sheets on, TV, more wardrobe, another cupboard. Yeah, there's so much room, like, this is what we're living for. But basically, that is our house tour. We're getting there, everything is like, it's so nice having so much space. Because in the flat, we're literally like, everything was just on top of each other. So now we have all this space, it's like living the dream. And yeah, just chilling, unpacking. But that is the house tour. Thank you so much for watching this kind of moving vlog, kind of house through vlog. I don't know, just moving house edition. And for now, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go wash my hair because it's got a lovely top knot. Please like, subscribe, comment down below. 
and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! <laughs>